Okay. Uh, NRL player to watch. I haven't done one of these videos in a while. And I'm going to focus on a player my team I support, the Canberra Raiders, and Charlie Gubb. Uh, very underutilised when he was at uh, the Warriors. Hasn't had a lot of game time. Uh, he's been obviously around the first team squad of the Warriors for most of the last three years. But as I say, not getting any opportunities. Um, Ricky Stewart's obviously seen something. Ricky Stewart is a very, very good coach. To get him to sign to the the, the Raiders is a big thing. Big move. To get that signature um, is is a big thing. Um, big ball carrier. Um, big tackler as well. Big hitter. Uh, good interchange forward to have. Um there have been comments that with Vaughan going to the St. George Illawarra Dragons last year that, you know, the pack looks a little bit weakened and I possibly would agree with that. But bringing in Charlie Gubb, um, he's a good replacement to have. Um, look for Ricky Stewart and the Raiders to make him a better player. Ricky Stewart has a knack for doing this. Um, Ricky Stewart's not often got it wrong with, with player development, I have to say. He's been very, very good on that front. Um, a lot of people will go, well, who, you know... Charlie Gubb, really? I'm like, yes. I, I honestly believe with the energy that he brings and the energy he will bring and the, and the frustrations he probably would have had at the Warriors by not getting the game time, not getting the chance to play, would have inspired him and made him make this move. Um, also, he used to play rugby union at youth club. He's another, he's another rugby union um, loss, rugby league steal, uh, developed as a union player. Um, so he's been developed by another code and leagues nicked him. Uh, it's happening more and more often. Um, normally it used to be the way around that a league player would be nicked by union, but it's happening more often that union players are getting nicked by league now in youth development stakes, and especially in Australia and New Zealand. It's happening more often, and he's a byproduct of that. Um, I would look for him to make a big impact from the off, um, and he, he attracts a cult following at the Warriors. He had a big fan following there. Um, wouldn't be surprised to see some of that. Those that that fan base follow him over to Canberra. Uh, he seems to be very popular with the fans and the locals, wherever he's you know he's, he's played. So it's good to see. Anyway, I'll leave that there. Uh, place your comments below. Um, like and subscribe, and I'll have some more videos. Thanks.